In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to stop websites from automatically opening in a new tab when using Microsoft Bing. This quick guide is perfect, even if you don't consider yourself tech savvy. It's a straightforward fix, and by the end, you'll easily navigate this small but sometimes frustrating issue. Imagine this, you're surfing the web using Bing and you click on a link hoping that it would load seamlessly in your current tab. Instead, a new tab pops open, taking you away from your current view and adding clutter to your browser. It can be quite the hassle, right? Fortunately, there's a simple way to remedy this, and I'm here to walk you through it step by step. First, head back to the main Bing homepage. Once you're there, direct your attention to the top right corner of the screen where you'll see three horizontal lines. This icon represents the menu, and by clicking on it, you'll expose a list of options. Select the one labeled Settings. Upon clicking, a drop-down menu will appear, and from there, click on More. This click will lead you to Bing's more expansive settings page, the hub for tweaking how your Bing experience works. Now take a little scroll until you end up on the Search section. Within this category, you'll notice a subsection titled Results. This is where you'll find the settings we need to adjust. In the Results area, you're going to spot two specific options. The first one says, open links from search results in a new tab or window. The second reads, open links from news results in a new tab or window. The goal here is to ensure both of these options are turned off. So if you find them toggled on, go ahead and switch them to off. Once you've confirmed that both options are turned off, continue scrolling down to the bottom of the settings page. Don't forget this crucial step. Click save to make sure all your changes are applied. It's a small detail, but pressing save is what solidifies these adjustments. And there you go. From now on, any links you click should stay within the same tab just as you'd prefer, rather than automatically launching a fresh one. I hope these instructions helped streamline your browsing experience. If you found this guide useful, consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to the channel for more concise tech tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.